Build that body count. Who cares? What's a body count anyway? And there's no at, at last seen come my status. You know, <laughs> the more you're going to have multiple amazing orgasms. orgasms. Yay. Yes. We are closing that orgasm gap by it's fire, by, by force. force. <laughs> and fake orgasms, if you want to fake an orgasm, come to me. I'm going to show you how not to. Hello, my name is Mothani Getao. Welcome to another episode of Just Doing Life, the podcast, a space where we explore all the parts of life that we do not like to say out loud. After all, we are all just winging it. Welcome to episode 20. What a milestone. Woot woot. We've done 20 episodes so far. And I'm joined by the amazing, the pleasure seeking. I'm an equity pleasure The pleasure advocate. Pleasure advocate. Yes. Bev Munga, aka Mnazamjua Kama, the vibrating lawyer. Yes. Kama Hauju, the vibrating lawyer. Have you been living under a rock? Most likely they have. <laughs> right? <laughs> hey, Bev. Today we are talking about female pleasure. Yes. So that is why you're saying we're decked out to kona mapocho pocho. The mapocho of the pochos. Mm-hmm. We have mapocho pocho here for the ladies. We have for the couples over here. Everyone, everyone's taken care of. The guys, some dudes, like, eh, you're taken care of. Today we're going to talk about female pleasure. Yes. And I think you're the best person to have this conversation yes, with. Yes, because I love pleasure. Not? Yes. Why not? I, before we start, there's uh-huh. something we always do on the right. podcast where we have to share a moment of joy from the previous week. Ah, so uh-huh. share a moment of joy from your past week. The past, also f- last week. Oh, hmm, should I say this? Say it. I no, have, that is the one we yes, want. Yes. <laughs> like, I rarely squat uh-huh. with a toy. Uh-huh. I normally squat with a, a person. Uh-huh. But last week I was like, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Yes. Oh, that's yes. So cool. What a way to start the podcast, eh? <laughs> <laughs> I know. Wait, in, you know what? Right into the pleasure. Yes. Okay. Like, I really, I, I don't know how it comes, it, it just, I, I kind of hold it off. Mm. I don't know why. Mm. But I just like, bzz, you know, my self-care session alone, I'm like, bzz, then I was like, whoop. I was like, yeah. <laughs> You should have seen me happy dancing. Yeah. <laughs> you meant to, yes. to be like, what? Yeah, exactly. Yes, that. yes, yes. I love it. Oh, my moment of joy this past week. I've actually not thought about it. Mm. Um, hmm. Moment of joy from this past week. I think um, the past week was my first, it was my first week on radio. Mm-hmm. So yes, ah, as a radio host. Yes. The, that would be my moment of joy, okay. doing the first full week and not freaking out and mm-hmm. doing really good shows. Yes. yes. Congratulations on that, actually. Congrats. Thank Congrats. You, Thank you. So let's just jump into it. Twende. Twanzi Hapo, how mm-hmm. do you define female pleasure? Initially, I thought female pleasure had to have a guarantee and results. Uh-huh. Like you had to have an orgasm after or a squat or whatever it was. Yeah. But then again, to be now the process. It doesn't have to have an end goal. Of course, I'm going to get angry <laughs> if you don't get me there. <laughs> but uh-huh. it's just the journey, just enjoying each other together. So initially, right, I think in Kuzeka, I'm getting a little bit older <laughs> and I'm realizing and knowing how, how my body operates and how my body works. Yeah. And now it's just the journey from the beginning, from the foreplay all the way to the end. Mm-hmm. I don't need to... It's obviously an added bonus, yeah, you know. Hey. It's obviously, happy ending, it's of imp- right? If it happens, of I'm importance, like, yes. <laughs> you know. And but because we tend to have sex just for that, at times yeah. we forget it's just the end result. Mm. So the pleasure for me is just it's a journey. Yeah. So yeah. someone has to take you through that yes, journey. Yes. Yes. It doesn't have to end again. Yes. It's amazing yeah. because I mean, I mean, sex like, should like, sex should end with happy. an orgasm. Yeah. I know, right? But it doesn't really, really necessarily have to lead there. And also, yeah. if you if if the journey is taken very nicely, yes, if you, you will definitely journey, yes get we, there. You will get there. You will get there. Yes. Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah. that's mm. cool. I love that. I love the idea of the journey because even for me, I think I had the same. It's like, okay, when it's like if it didn't happen, I'm like, Sata, yeah, what was the point? <laughs> what was that? Yeah, Body like, count wasted. Like, oh, what a waste. <laughs> There's even someone who said that you should, at if you are asked what your body count is. I mean, I don't count. Is, I mean, I don't no, count. No, it's like, if I didn't orgasm. If I didn't orgasm, then... Can I just give you a throwback of Kitambo, like, more than f- 15 years ago? Yeah. I'm, I cannot say it right now because I don't really care. I was, I had a, uh, an affair. Uh-huh. I was I was shooting on my boyfriend then. <laughs> Kitambo. <laughs> now, and of course, now, when, I, when, when, when he caught me, yeah. father, when I, it came to the light that I was shooting on him, I was like, babe, I didn't even come anywhere. <laughs> 
surprisingly because we are still friends now he keeps reminding me that he's like eh, but you didn't come i'm like yeah, i didn't come so he didn't so come you didn't come so, so did i really <laughs> did that really that's the question <laughs> like you can't yeah. call that cheating i didn't that's, i don't think that's cheating <laughs> You know the body count still remains there because our encounter like is zero. It is, yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, it's like but it's still just new. like you're told every new year start from it, scratch. It starts from <laughs> it's like truly I'm a new person, yeah. new year new me. Mm-hmm. That means new body count. Oh, uh, <laughs> yes, yes, yes. So I yeah, love yeah. That. What was your first interaction with pleasure like with female pleasure? Of course like sexual. Sexual. Yes. Uh I can say hmm cuz You know when you were told when you lose your virginity mm-hmm. it's painful and tough? Yeah. I don't think mine was painful. Oh, me too. It wasn't as well, right? Yeah. yeah like I actually that guy knew what he was doing mm-hmm. and he knew there was a virgin. Yeah. And I think he took his time on me. Uh-huh. Let me tell one thing, for play. Uh-huh. Please, please, please. Yeah, Eat that pussy. <laughs> Lick it. Lick that pussy. Like to me he really made me feel comfortable. Yeah. And the fact that he went down on me to me is is a plus plus. Mm. Cuz you know that your first time can be very scary. Yes. Right and then you might meet a guy who may be older than you or more experienced than you are mm-hmm. and you tend to find yourself t- or him just like you know mm, like he doesn't know what he's doing. Yeah. yeah. So he was very quite gentle on me and yeah, I actually really really enjoyed sex. And I was like, mm. ooh. Oh, I was missing this for 21. Yes. <laughs> Cuz I lost it at 21 or something. Yeah. So yeah, I, I would say yeah, he was quite gentle on me. Oh. But it was head. Uh, oh the head was really good. That's, I it, think it, about it, the head today. It, it marinated. It you marinated nicely. me nicely. <laughs> yeah. In as much as I was so uncomfortable because like you know your first time is very nerve wracking. Your yes. first time is like oh my god what, what to expect. Mm-hmm. But he really put me at ease. Yeah. That's yeah. actually very interesting. So for me my first interaction with pleasure it was actually self pleasing mm. and I don't even know how Oh so please pleasing was there. How, yeah. how can I forget it? It was no, all, it, yeah. No, oh. that, like your first time. I think I was in spin from what uh-huh. and I was like I, I didn't even discover I didn't even know what a clit was you know Yes unfortunately in our 844 systems and stuff okay it's not 844 anymore you know since the scene was there <laughs> um like biology is just biology Yes body anatomy ni 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 they never mentioned things about the clit or the gist it was just mm. Like how the body was, functions, and we were we were taught more about reproductive, eh, about like just the you get pregnant. This mm. is this are your don't have sex. You have sex. Have, yeah. eh, it was, exactly. It was never about. No one cared about the even the sex itself. No, it was it no was one, not discussed. Yeah, exactly, it was What? like out there. We were just talking about like oh ovaries, spans yeah. together. Now you're pregnant. Baby, nine Please. months. Eh, push. That's right? it. Yeah. So I think my, my pleasure. Yes, first of all, it was. Personally, yeah, should have been from two from three. I can't remember what year I was in boarding, and I remember very well it was on a Saturday entertainment. You know uh-huh. when we used to go for enter yeah. in the dining hall, you guys are watching movies and stuff. Mm-hmm. But if you didn't want to go, you didn't want to go. Yeah. So me, I just went to the to my um to my bed you know, to the dorms. And I'm just like, <laughs> what is that? I don't. Yeah. You know, again, we are not taught to talk about. Even having being horny, yes. Because I didn't know. Because you're six, you're 17 years old. Your hormones There's are everywhere. Desires, like yeah. me, I was just hearing ding. Like I was having a heartbeat on my clit. Yeah. And I was like, "What is this thing throbbing? <laughs> <laughs> Why are you throbbing? Yeah. I didn't even know it was actually it's just. It's a body. Like you're just horny. Mm. I was like, "Ebu nikidika guze kaza kutrob." I need to leave. I was like, "Aya, what is this? Like I'm adding, I'm adding fire." <laughs> And that was actually my first ever squat on yeah. my own. Oh. And I was like, "Come on, Mujiko Jolia," because I didn't time. even know. Whoa. Because I thought I peed on myself. Mm. And I was so scared. Yeah. And then again, big again, we are all embarrassed. Like, oh my god, mm. like I've never you can't even tell your your you best don't talk friend about it. It's, exactly because we're taught not to talk about What you do know is that you enjoy it was really good. Yeah. But that was it. It's like you felt did you feel like that warm sensation in oh. your body and you're like, "Hey, I'm oh. sweating and I don't know why." Ah, I can't <laughs> it. it was so good and thank God the dome was empty. Guess who got entertainment? Who got scream? Oh no. Oh. No. <laughs> Which is very weird when I masturbate I don't scream. Oh yeah, me too. You like, too. Yeah. I'm, I'm a very silent <laughs> alone. But with somebody won't. <laughs> Music oh, no. loud day eh, because yes neighbors work una go and get like um excuse me kid yes. umneza what you talking about lala exactly yes but oh, yeah no, cool. i didn't scream but it was something i really enjoyed and i was like wow mm. did you how come no one never told in a while on your own you're like you, you did you find time 
It's hard to find time in boarding school. Yeah. It's really hard. Of course, oh. you in a, maybe in the middle of the night, mm. you're like, hmm, maybe let me play with make a boss, shock a bean. Yeah. But that was it. So for yeah. me, I think I wasn't in boarding school yet, but it was after, just before. I think it was. It happened at home, but I was also still a teenager. Mm. And I don't even know, I don't remember how it all started, but I know I was just in bed. Yeah. And then I was like, oh, okay. Mm. And then you're like, huh, you just touch that and they're like, and then you're feeling things in your body and you're like, I like the things What I'm about feeling. nipples? Maybe it was my nipples, I think, because, ah. you know, when you're such an adolescent, then as a teenager, mm-hmm. like your body's just on fire. Ah. Like you could just pass through, like, you know, goes at Oh, yeah, there was those things. Yeah. Also, I don't remember, like, the first time I started feeling things. I remember, like, I used to have bigger boobs when yeah. I was younger. Yeah. And they used to make me uncomfortable. So I never used to, like, touch them uh, or anything. Yeah, I was I'm uncomfortable. Yeah. yeah, I was insecure about having big boobs right but um i don't remember like just even the touching thing and then i was like i was feeling things and i was just touching myself and i was like oh yeah and i was like and it wasn't a long thing but it was so good that i went and wrote it in my diary oh I was my like, god well 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 with the nipples <laughs> or with yeah with, oh, yeah. with, with the, no, with me, the i came with nipples ah oh. I did actually, and guy, I not not that I'm a lesbian, but you know we're experimenting things in high school. I'm yeah. sorry. <laughs> so one of the girls in school, yeah. I don't know what she, I, I don't know what she was doing. Even I think she was my experience. You know some yeah. people, because me was still a virgin. You know, in, in high school, the guys who actually lost their virginity mm-hmm. very young. The people mm-hmm. who actually promiscuous in high school and stuff. Yes. So me I was quite naive for coming from a religious family and all that, because mm-hmm. religion plays a very big part when it comes to demystifying sex and stuff. Yes. And she was just like. Hey, hey. <laughs> And I actually had an orgasm with nip- through nipples. Oh, for me, that happened like later now in my adult ah, life. Ah, right, yeah. right, right. When uh, now I think my boobs became smaller. And now then you're now more I comfortable. Like, I was loving them. Now I was like, uh, okay, you're became cute. smaller. Zilena <laughs> Wapi. <laughs> I don't know. Imagine. Aisha. Like I woke up one day and it's like I, I honestly was like almost a double D. I, I think need to quite make it up. Yeah, and then quite tiny for you to have big boobs, eh? Yeah, so now, it was, now that was the thing ah, that made me uncomfortable. Mm, like, I have the, a small body, mm. but I have like a big bust. So, I have a letter pin. Oh, eh, 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 eh. <laughs> because also I have a flat butt. So, oh my god! <laughs> and then, because the, then you always scared it, like you're okay, like hey, this, I like you want to wear put big t-shirts, t-shirts like, to cover. I don't want ah. you to see, so it looks like. So now, yeah. even for me, the with the with the nipple, mm-hmm. it came later, and then now I realized, oh, it's also a pleasure point for me. Yes. Now as an adult, but yes. before that, it took a while for me to notice. But mm. my first interaction, hey, I wrote about it in my diary, and then I was like, what if someone reads my diary uh, and sees this? I was like, no. So I tore that page. I, me too. And then I hid it, concealing. <laughs> No, me, I threw, I had to throw the book in the, in a latrine, in a pit latrine, because I was getting a bit embarrassed. What if, what if someone finds it? Yeah. Like, you're hiding it in the most discreet places, yes. yes. Then I'm like, but then no, again, in your mind, hey, like, me, what I, if? I tore that page, Nikai Just that one. That one. Nikai Fitcher, like, you see that, there's the ceiling, that Kambao, the... I know what you mean, I'm looking at this, the yeah. Crack. Yeah. I hid it there. So now, it was like, it's it's a secret that just, I have with just myself. You. Is it still there? I don't know, I because I never removed it. Uh, yeah, I think it's probably. Is it still like your there. mom's, your grandma's? Where it was, was it? My mom's house. That that house still stands. They don't live in it right now. There's someone uh, else who oh. lives there. They read your secrets. Those who came in and they the whole place out. Renovate. Oopsie. But like it was such. a... I was just like, oh my god. And then after that, I was like, again, I think whenever I was bored and I'm in bed, not doing, I'd be like, well, might as well. Yeah. Mine didn't continue much because I, I think again that guilt. I don't know. Ah, it's a, yeah, like in as much I really wanted secret. to yes, but then again I'm like, guy, is it right? Is it mm. wrong again? Then our school was Catholic school. It's one of those <gasps> things you're like. If if you're enjoying, finds yeah, it. exactly. I love also the fact that you don't know how far it would go because mm. it's like sometimes you're like, like you were saying that you're squatting, you're like, oh, now am I ping? Am I going to say, yeah, yeah, ping? I don't know what P was, yes. uh, what squatting was, yeah, until, oh, yeah. That is so Because I think even in high school, me, once in a while, in the middle of the night when I'm insomniac, <laughs> yeah, when you wake up randomly and it's not time to, I mean, to, to wake up, wake, bake, <laughs> masturbate. That's my thing. Wake, bake, masturbate. No, yeah, yeah wake, yeah, I have to. That what? is the, Ay, that's the that's rule. It. Yes. I love that. Yeah. Let's talk about the orgasm gap. Now that yes. we're we're uh-huh. talking about mm-hmm. we're talking about we started to say it doesn't have to happen, but it's a bonus. It's mm. about the journey. Yeah. We we've had stories about the orgasm gap and according to statistics, um heterosexual women 
are the ones who get the least amount of orgasms. This is why I started G Spot Kenya. Yes. Let's talk about <laughs> it. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. So let's talk about what, first of all, before we even get to, yeah, this, how to, how pleasure we, and stuff. Yes, and toys how, and stuff. Do yeah, yeah, yeah. Get, how do we close the gap mm. with self pleasure? What is your take first on the orgasm gap? Is, oh my, yes. One of the things I keep saying is, um, Men and women, a man to me is a gas cooker. Okay. And a woman is a charcoal, jukwa mm-hmm. maka, right? Because a gas is like kuchu. Yeah. Ishawaka. Yeah. You're into, you're, and for a woman, jukwa mm-hmm. maka, you have to put paraffin, you have to Upe angle, <laughs> you have to angle the 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 jiko. The, uh, the side, the wind is The coming wind, from you have to be like, pepeta. you're pepetaing, you're putting newspapers, you're doing so many things for, that's how a woman's body is, mm. like to warm it up from, from the beginning. Yeah. So you can't do it half uchoke, because for, again, as a man is kuchu, asha amka. Mm. Yeah. And then, and you know, a man, I think 99.99% of men orgasm. Always. <laughs> Always. <laughs> I don't know what's, unless there's something happening, they're stressful. Yeah. Uh, and, and I know they keep saying that when a man is stre- they have stressed. no money and stuff, apparently they don't even get an erection and stuff. We still ah. are like, they still have an erection. This man. I know, like this one. This too, man. They, yes. they just see a short skirt and immediately. Eh, you send someone a random text. And right. You don't go yeah, so the like, gap is doing? quite huge. Yeah. But then again, I think it goes back to knowing your body, number one, mm-hmm. but also your partner. If you have multiple partners, it's a bit difficult unless yeah. every, every particular partner knows your how your body operates and stuff. Yeah. But and even for a, for if you have like a stable partner and stuff, I think it makes more sense for you for you and your partner to actually sit down and as your miliako. Mm. Like for you to sit down if you because again like I said it's heterosexual because mostly by the gay couples let all my lesbian friends enjoy sex. They come all the time and I'm like how? It's like teach us your way. Yeah, teach us your way. <laughs> Is it because I think again? Woman to woman is because you know your body more. Mm. Is it because you're taking your time? Mm. So all these things, I think, factor in. Yeah. But I think the gap is quite huge, to be honest. Like, mm. most women don't ha- actually have an orgasm. Like, most of them can actually count. The number of orgasms they Yeah. Had. Yeah. Most of them, the women who That's don't even like know what an orgasm is. thing means nothing. It means nothing. <laughs> We, not most we, actually it's the women who don't who have never had an orgasm. Yeah. They just Which, have never I'm like I'm even sometimes I, I wonder, there's times I sit down and I ask myself, like even now with our parents, because us we can talk about it and be like, okay. Yeah, uh, yeah. But like I'm imagining like with the, the generation of our parents mm. where sex is for like forbidden. Yeah, just for, for repercussion, yeah, just for it's like we're, kids. we're doing this for the children. Or for the man. Or yeah, because I'm a kuja mm, already mm, mm, it's like mm. let's go. Because at least with us you can say, okay. Um, you can orgasm in other ways because we're we're more open to experimenting. Yeah, with different the technology. Things. There's internet. Hey. There's toys. There's so many things. Exactly. Yeah. Where I'm like, okay, cool. It doesn't have because for them, I felt like for most of them, sex is one way. So the pleasure is for the man. It, they it were was, never yeah. taught about pleasure for themselves. It nope. was never a discussion. It's not even expected to be. Given. Not even our parents. Imagine our great grandparents who used to practice FGM. This is why I really hate oh, FGM. Yeah. Because FGM was there to just combat women, to make women feel like, don't be a hoe. Yeah. Because FGM was basically because apparently when you come of age or whatever, you're going to mm. be horny because you got, you got a cleat. Yeah. So those kind of FGMs, and then I'm very angry about FGM to date, it still happens to date. Which is very sad. It's, it's very sad because yeah. you're doing it it basically you're just to control a woman's body. Yeah, because that's also, the whole point. With the with the mutilation, it's basically they remove the pleasure points. So yeah. it's like you even when you like you can't experience the pleasure. Basically, that's how yeah, it and works, then right? yeah. Plus, depending on the uh, depending on what culture you come from, because there's some cultures where it's just the clit, mm-hmm. like other they, they actually show you they show now your lips as well. Yeah, it's just for peeing and periods. That's it. No. That's the when people, women dying during childbirth because you shall forget Ulifungu already. It's just it painful during the first experiment oh when you're having God. sex. Yeah. You're literally the... shut. Oh my God. That yeah. Is so so wrong. depending on where you come from, Somalis do it differently. Waembu, Wameru, mm-hmm. it's all different everywhere in the world. Yeah. And I think it should be, that thing should be abolished. To, I agree. Yeah. Because it's, it's just there to control a woman's body. Yes. That's which, it. And we're like, why? Wh- what's the need to control women's body? For them, because to, have, cause to them, if you have a clit, if you if you're horny, you're promiscuous. You're out there. You're sleeping with everybody. What about the men? Yeah, I'm like. Also, why is it that? Wait, it's wait, wait, one you way? Cut, yeah, why did you cut the man? Because for the man, circumcision for a man is for 
they say it's for cleanliness and yeah. you know when it comes to adolescence and you know spams and stuff just to be clean and diseases and STIs or whatever infections. Yeah. Well, for women it's purely just to make them not sleep around. That is so yeah. Oh my god, that is so wrong. Yeah. And I'm like, who are you to decide? If me I want to go sleep around, who are you to tell me no? Because we, we belong we belong to men. That's what they think. We, Which is uh, yeah. That's a whole other conversation. That's a conversation another anyway. Day. Yes, yes, let's move on. <laughs> because if we go there, hatu tatoka. Hey, you in baka yes. Yeah. So now when we think about pleasure, um when we're talking about now the orgasm gap and yeah. the thing I was talking about is like there's different ways to attain pleasure that is not just about penetration. Yeah. Let's go let's go there. Yeah. So what are some of the ways you would recommend that we use to close that orgasm gap? Personally, I really advocate for masturbation. Mm -hmm. It's not everyone's cup of tea. When I, when I started doing this 11 years ago, everyone was a bit angry with me on Twitter and everywhere because yeah. KOT is way. <laughs> right? Um, because again, what was I saying? Um, we're talking about masturbation. Masturbation, yes. Masturbation, so yes. to me, masturbation to me is very key because it's how you learn your body. Yes. How else do you know? How, tell your partner how to please me if you can't please yourself. Mm -hmm. Like, how do you know what feels good on you? Yes. So I really advocate for masturbation. You don't have to even put anything up there. You know, back in the day in high school, they used to. I was in a boarding again, like I've mentioned, and they even banned carrots. In guess what? In agriculture class. <laughs> They, they weren't allowed to, to nini. Yeah, do other, yeah. Because people were and me, I using them as... For one, our agriculture, the form for students. Yeah, yeah. Carrots. Yeah, they were, yes. And they were being stolen in the shamba, by the way. But me, I thought people were stealing. We eat them. For, 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 for Gideri? Nope. Yeah, I was stealing nope. to make the Gideri. It was for big Gideri as well, but yeah. for people, people... Even Kumbuka, there's even test tube getting lost in the, in the lab. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> Oh wow! Exactly, yeah. So even my point, your class was advanced. My point is, people will be masturbating for years, and even you're too young But people are very yes. scared. Of, yeah. So I really advocate for masturbation for you to know your body. If not, at least if you have a, 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 an understanding partner, mm -hmm. sit down, discuss, know your body. Even something as you know, women don't do this. Yeah. Take a mirror mm -hmm. and put the mirror in front of you and look, look at yourself. At, yes. Look at your body. Like look, Yangalia Vizuri. Yeah. Things like that. Because it, it makes, if you don't know your body, who else will know your body? You should mm -hmm. know your body more. It's your temple. It's yes. your, it's the only body you're ever going to have. It lives with you. It lives with you forever. You live within it, whichever it is. Exactly, yeah. So I really advocate for, yeah, masturbation. No yes. offense. <laughs> yeah, no, yeah. Enjoy yourself. Masturbate. You don't have to even, if you're scared of penetration, mm -hmm. thank God we have the cleats. No wonder I'm, I'm angry about FGM again. Yes. Because the cleat is specifically there for you to enjoy yourself and just rub it, know your body. Just know how what feels good. Mm. If it feels good, you can uh, tell, your partner, to tell, tell someone, your partner, tell somebody yes. how, yeah, how I like it as well. And also that's how you know what you don't like. Exactly. Well, I don't like the, yes. Yeah, when yeah. someone can be doing Like I hate like, being no, fingered. Actually, I really hate being fingered. Uh -huh. it's, not, it's not my thing. Yeah. I don't know it's because of... Uh, um, uh, uh, it's called what OCD. Yeah, maybe the nails are not cut. Uh, I don't know. I feel like yeah. someone's going to. I don't know. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> I but get yeah, that. yeah. Because I think in knowing yourself, then you know the things you like, the things you don't like. Mm. And also, I advocate for touching your body, knowing where your pleasure points yeah, are. Yeah, and, and not just your, your vagina yes, and your valve your and entire, stuff. Your entire, entire body could be your ears. Mm. It could be anything. Mm, even like that thing, because there's someone who will be like, please don't touch my boobs. Yeah. Just like, please don't. Yeah. And there's someone who's like, don't touch my ass like that. Yeah. Don't grab, don't. Yeah. 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 So I think. And then the, the, the other one, oh, grab me. Yeah. Yeah, it's like, exactly. by the way, slap it. Don't, yeah. Like, turn like me over, flip me. This is me. <laughs> I'm a BDCM babe. Yeah. I just want to be spanked hard. <laughs> oh, oh, my God, it, it turns me on. Yeah. Everyone oh, is different. Uh, yes. Exactly. Exactly. Okay, no, I, I, no, I, I didn't spank myself, though, but still. <laughs> but, I, <laughs> like, but also, even with a partner, mm. you can also experiment with a partner where you say, try this. You're like, okay, yeah, no thanks. I, I, thought, I don't think we like that one. Mm. So, as first you know yourself, and then if you're with someone, there's things you can find out with other people as well. Yeah, right. I love that. Yeah. Oh, exactly. Where Where do we? How do we bring in our toys? One of the, the most the difficult there. things, especially when you're when you're alone, it's easier to get a toy and stuff. Yes. But when you're dating, you're in a married relationship, whatever you are, mm -hmm. and people keep asking me. So, like today, I had a client asking. Babe, how do you introduce this new toy I've got? Where am I going to hide it? Mm -hmm. Like, hide she's, it yeah, but her point is to hide it. Yeah, 
She was more scared of her husband finding out more than anything else. Oh, wow. And I'm like, why are you married? May I think to me marriage should be open to the, like, this is what I like. This is what, yes. Babe, I feel like we should introduce new toys, toys. to the yeah. bedroom. What do you think about it? Mm-hmm. Things like that. So I think it's important for you to have a communication. If you're with a partner, communicate with the partner. If you're not, please just come to me and say, dear. But yeah. If you're not with a partner. You're with a partner. If you're like me, when yeah. you like... You think of men and you go like, huh. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah. It's like, like, do I have to deal with the person attached yeah. to them? <laughs> yeah, yeah. But yeah, I think toys, the good thing about toys nowadays, they made life much more easier. Yeah. Um, and then because, and then the good thing about toys as well, they have different settings, sizes, mm. they're different sizes and shapes. And There's something and for everyone. Something for everyone. Yeah. If you don't like penetration because it's not for everybody, penetration, mm. then you have external and I think that's, toys. The, that's the importance of actually even if you're with a partner having yeah. those conversations mm. because when you know you don't like penetration, it's like what other things can we do? Exactly. And are they open to that? Yeah. Also, do you think there's something as like pleasure compatibility now that I think about actually, it? Actually, they, they should. Yeah, they should. Right? Mm. Because I'm like, there's someone who's like, I only want penetration. Yeah. And maybe that's the guy. And you're like, actually, no. Yeah. Ooh. I actually don't like yeah. Penetration. penetration so what do we do then because then it's like we like it do we walk away I because think of that, that. Be a, actually the right the love languages yeah there should be a sex language sex language what do you like this or language? not what's your sex language actually <gasps> babe you should be the one to make By this one for that i will put it on your website i know right yes i i i'll definitely i think I we definitely. should have a sex language Mm. Because we have for everything, we mm. have to do argument language, mm. we have our love languages, we have our, what was the other one? Like, your anger, anger whatever. Oh, how really? You, yes, there's even one where you do a test to see how you process anger. And I'm like, we should have one for sex. Yeah, because yeah it's it should like be. Because it's like a big part we of to be compatible, but before we say, that should be actually on Tinder or this dating yeah, site. Yeah, compatibility. Yeah. <laughs> right? you, you have a sexual They're like, core, no, I don't think we're going to be compatible sexually. Exactly. So, bye. To the next, you can click so all, you can like have all the other ninis yeah. and all the check but not there. and sex but when it is comes to quite important it's very it's vital like in, a in a relationship it is very important see we have relationships that end because of lack yes. of or someone is demanding too much and you're like yeah. imagine I can't keep up with this you. is where I keep advocating for the Kenyan jails to actually have even um, um, conjugal, conjugal visits. visits I'm um, sorry Be- they, they don't have no Oh, really? Yeah, because I assumed yeah. it's like we use the same system. <laughs> I know, <laughs> because right? They, they kind of dictated all these other things, I would assume, even in prison. Yeah. They'd be like, yeah, make sure they get... No, to them, sex oh, really? is not important. It's not... It's not I didn't know that. Unless we Google, I don't know. But I don't think it is. I'm curious. Yeah. Aki will find yeah, out. Yeah, we'll find out. So when when you're having the conversation, say, with your partner, what are the some, some of the questions you think someone should ask when you're saying, let's add... Let's bring in sex, sex toys into an inni. What are some of the questions you think someone should ask? I think one of the things you should first ask, first of all, are you comfortable with this? Because mm-hmm. number one, as a woman say, babe, I am not here to replace because that has been a very big issue for yes. me because men think these things, these plastics, let me call them plastics yeah. now, are going to replace them. Mm. They won't replace you. Yes. This is just, again, this, I call this AIDS. They mm. aid your sex life. Okay. They're not there to replace. You can't. I'm sorry. You this can't thing won't. So go buy a into me uba fair into me pesa. Like you know what I mean. I knew Lizzie how my and, day was. And exactly. It's yeah. this, what toys do is just to help you get there. Mm-hmm. So like, like for example, I'm in a long distance relationship, right? Mm-hmm. Instead of me sleeping around and fucking around, yeah, I rather have a toy. Yes. First of all, no diseases, no HIV, you know, you know, pregnancies, mm. no but, but drama, drama and stuff. I'm not talk about it, yeah. right? <laughs> but yeah, so I think uh, couples should just sit down. First of all, sit down and discuss the whole point. Should we introduce a sex toy? Yes. Number one, why do you want to introduce a sex toy? Mm. Is it that I'm not enough? Mm-hmm. Is it because you you're an explore? Yeah. Like, sit down and just talk about it. Mm. But then again, it, they don't replace. And, and they, I, 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 they cannot replace. It's not the yeah. same thing. And because I've seen that conversation online a lot mm. where you see, um, especially men who come and say, oh, these women are trying to make us compete. Compete. With sex yeah. toys. So you, you're, you're the problem then. Yeah. Come on, if, if a plastic, again, calling it plastic. Yeah. Like, if something, if a plastic can make you feel inferior. Yes. 
Julie, say, what's wrong with you? Mm. What is your yeah, yeah exactly? Or oh, ask your partner coming from inside the house. Exactly. Mm. Ask your partner. Then again, discuss why. How comes I'm not getting you there? Yes. Instead of oh, yeah. exactly yes yeah what let's work it? it out yes let's figure out is it because nakujanga tunko like I'm ready let's go yeah that I don't prepare you is it that maybe the things I'm doing are the things you don't like right exactly it goes back to that whole it goes back thing, to knowing it, your body yes because now you, that's why you're like yeah but me this is what I like and that's yeah. not what you do so it's harder for me to get there because uh, you only do what you like and you never do what I like and I've also found women who they can't wait for the habits to go to work or whatever. Mm. What is left? Oh, Jim, yeah. Because also you don't want them to know that you I are. know. Ah. And then again, honesty, like me, I just, I don't fake orgasms anymore. I'm yeah. too old for that. Ooh, it takes, can we talk about yes, that? Yes. Because it takes way more muscles yeah. to fake an orgasm than the muscles that bring an orgasm. Mm. You could fake, oh my God. No, babes, me, I'm honest with you. I'm like, okay, babes, I didn't yeah. come. I'm, I'm, I, I, please, and, and I really wanted to get there. Yeah. So you know men how they sleep immediately. As a basi alala kidogo basi. Pinduka. Asha asha ngorota. Na wako acha tumalize hii safari. So just like it's always under the pillow okay sir. Yeah. But you see if there was that discussion. Mm. Babe you didn't get me there or come first round yako. So yeah. basi. I'm okay with that. Like if you know you're going to come in two minutes. Mm. Sawa. I'll be mentally prepared because yes. maybe you haven't seen me in a week or in a day or whatever it was. Yeah. So I'll let you ha- k- crack your nut mm-hmm. and then second round, third yeah. round in yangu. <laughs> As I'm going in and you kind of kind of like you're yeah. going is it an hour for we taking tea breaks? Mm. Water breaks? Are we <laughs> going to like pique. you know what I mean? Yeah. Exactly. But again, oh my god, communication. So, I yes. I wish people could communicate with their partners. Mm. Cuz this is Cause the person you've chosen to have sex with. That, yeah. It goes back to communication. It's that's, all that's about communication. I'm, There's yeah. nothing else. Even introducing toys is communication, babe. Mm. I feel like we need toy to bring this toy. I'm not bringing this toy because I feel like you're, you're inadequate. In, inadequate. Or, yeah. No, it's just to spice things. It's not yeah. about you. Yeah. It's like, because at least we know whenever this happens, you often get off. Yes. This is an aid to yeah. also make sure that every time we both of us at least everyone get, enjoyed, yes. everyone got what they wanted out yes. of the situation. And even and even it even makes more sense when you're having sex with the partner together to use the toys to together. together. Yeah. Like this cock ring, for example, because not the, what the cock ring does. Mm-hmm. The cock ring tends to uh, be on the guy as well. So the guy is wearing this on on his penis as well. Uh huh. So it's kind of giving you. Oh, so it's vibrating both it's, ways. It's, 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 ah. it's vibrating on him. And it's also and vibrating. Ah. So the cleat, this is in the cleat, and this is this vibration is on him as well on the penis. Okay, in the penis, dog or in the But you do get the point. Yeah, I like, guess. Like, it. like, like literally, uh, this is on him vibrating, yes, and uh-huh. this is on you vibrating. So both once it's penetrating you, mm. you're also like it's actually it's it's servicing both of yes, you at the same, same time. time. Yeah, that makes sense. exactly. I get that. Yes, yes, ah. yeah. So the, the, so you see, that's the, the point. Toys. That's exactly. why you should be open. To it's open, it because yeah. Because even now, even you are also gaining. You're also gaining from that. exactly. Also, the other thing is like, why would you be opposed to something that brings your partner pleasure? Pleasure. And also, they're asking you yeah. to be a part of it. Yeah, yeah. Because I, I think, think it's a turn on. It's just good. Right? Exactly. Yes. I think I also think the same. I'm like, hey, if someone's like, hey, babe, you want to like? Because yeah. if, if he's the one who even starts the conversation, you're like, um, removes okay. everything. Yes, <laughs> uh, for sure. Like, Apo ko like, okay, sure. But in truth, you're like, you're like, oh, I've been yes. waiting for this day. I'm so gr- it's like I'm so glad you brought this up. Yeah. Um, yeah. Actually, there's this one that I think we should yeah, try. Yeah. Exactly. When you okay, so we've talked this the conversation part. Actually, by there I've googled about the conjugal rights. Oh right. Um, and it says in Kenya, conjugal rights are protected in the Marriage Act. However, to date, no law has been made to allow conjugal visits yeah. for inmates, despite numerous calls from prisoners and their mm-hmm. spouses over mm-hmm. the years. Mm-hmm. So, oh wow! So you have conjugal rights if we're married and we're at home, but mm-hmm. if you go to prison, that is your. Pro- because if you're in prison, your your rights are that's it. They're taken. That's, that's it. Yeah. Oh wow. This is why I pray to God in any single way. This way in Yeah. Me, I like I have had sleepless nights thinking about it. Like <laughs> even like you know how <laughs> people, people get angry. Yeah. yeah. Like no, like when I see people fighting in a bar, me, it's like, me, me, me I'm those right chicks now. who are scared. <laughs> I take my hand back. I mean, I'm a coward. Me, this is one when I should back up because I find myself in prison. I don't have sex. Yeah. I no 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 no. no what's <laughs> 
like yeah. please i did not sign up for this yeah, i did not sign up for the that letter if people start any new things on the road you're like please i'm not trying to go to prison yeah no thank you yeah eliminate me eliminate from this conversation. exactly <laughs> i don't want to oh, but those. that's yeah. actually really sad it's really so sad it's like oh wow because then if imagine umenda because also when i think about it um of course of course there's those people who've like had who've done like heinous crimes yes, i get yeah. now I'm, i'm i'm thinking of like you know like that mother who said you stole a chicken to feed her yeah. her kids and i'm like yeah don't even deserve to be in jail for that there's some know, things this yeah, system of ours but also our systems are yeah. broken to an extent Oof, yeah. where someone can actually be innocent but they end up in prison so yeah oh wow that's yeah. a Huh. I always sad, for some reason sad. I always assumed that nope. conjugal rights are like a global no nope, not in Kenya thing. and there's other places where prisons are like homes it's an estate mm. I I saw a docu where um, yeah I, I think uh, the Scandinavian yeah, those countries, countries. <laughs> and it's like and you can live I think they can't live beyond a certain mm. it's like an island um they don't have guards they don't have the whole but they, they have, have everything house, TVs the internet You, yeah they have like workshops where they go it has to be to, Denmark or, Swe- or, yeah, or Sweden or Sweden or yeah and i remember watching that doc and i was like ah cuz for them they're saying going to that place the aim is rehabilitation they just want you to know what you did was wrong so you're being removed ah. from your family oh, that is the punishment is being right, removed from your family right. but they are so is a conjugal right there yeah mm. even like they bring your people they can stay even like street for the weekend your family Aisha. can visit yes and then it's like a house that has two people can never like, be kenya can never be kenya <laughs> first of all they'll be like ah we're building new houses why yeah yeah so when i saw that i was just like oh so i don't know i've always assumed conjugal rights mm, are yeah. universal rights yeah Apparently, not for africa not. not for us man so say someone is now we've talked away from the ones in relationship yeah. i am a single person i want to start um, experimenting where do i start clitoral uh-huh for you to find out if you're actually into toys actually or you're yeah. into do you oh this is that's wrong <laughs> believe your mic can get that yes i can speak it speaking yes put it here oh we're speaking <laughs> yes. oh, oh okay <laughs> So there's some tiny tiny ones as well because not everyone is into inserting. Yes. Before you know how your body is, the tiny little ones is like this. Mm-hmm. But nowadays they come very back in the day toys used to look like a they, real penis. It looked and it was so big and big. Yeah. And the quality like wasn't that movies. good. Like pure plastic. Nowadays everything is now silicone because silicone is much more better for your body. Mm-hmm. This is medical silicone. So the same silicone that goes on the boobs for example. Yeah. That's medically, you know, approved the same silicone. So you can start with tiny toys like this. Mm-hmm. Just for the clit or for the nipples for you to figure out what you what like. You like. Oh, you can you run oh, yeah. your through your body. body. Uh-huh. You can feel all the vibrations before yes. you go down there because I also feel like even for play should be just for partnered people. People, yes. Yeah. You can just play yeah, yourself. Play yourself ah. and just touch everywhere and just feel the whole. So there are toys specifically that were created for just the clit. Uh-huh. Something small, something discreet. It's very hard for you to tell even for example what this oh oh yes. actually, actually yeah, that one the lipstick oh, that one yes it's a very small it, it oh, looks like a real button. lipstick yeah long yes. press so it's a long press Ooh, oh yeah. that's strong and the old one is for people the, who are listening we're doing what is it called ASMR ASMR yeah that's strong and that's just number one. it has 10 vibrations what do you even tell yeah you just keep the more you press Ooh. the more you feel the vibrations going yeah cuz i'm feeling it the patterns Oh yeah, yeah. No, that makes a sound yeah. Oh, this one's like ooh, ooh, ooh. Oh my yeah. lord, this feels so good and it's just in my hand. Just <laughs> in my hand. Yeah, so the toys were made to be like that. That's yes. very cute. It, it, it this looks one like is, a lipstick. This, the one we're talking about is actually designed like a lipstick. Yeah. Yeah. That's a, yeah, so and just for the cleat really. Mm. So it's for the lips down there. Yes. These are the lips. So there's toys uh-huh. that are specifically ju- for your lips, for the mm-hmm. lips right? <laughs> and then it, it, it even has a cover yeah. such that you can when it's in your bag yeah, no one's airport, going to need whatever by exactly or whatever. exactly oh, until now someone to, uh, unless someone borrows Bev, give me your lipstick like I'm I'm like, like, like no it through your bag they're like ah ukona lipstick ya red kumbe akozi lazam na mbona ida kuna kuna talk na mbona look at you yeah ah goodness yeah so the thing is 
toys have really evolved in time. Mm. During this 11 years in the business, if you if you told me I would get here 11 years ago, I'd have said no. Ah. Because even what was in the market, getting them from China or getting them from anywhere you're getting the toys from, yeah. it was just the typical, quote unquote, dildo. Mm. Veiny. Big, yes. ugly, not powerful, not bad Does operated. It, you can't. Like, you have to hide it. That's why people were hiding. People were hiding it because it looks like a real thing. Like yeah. you can't even hide. Like nowadays, like you've seen the lipstick. You see things like the rose. So, yeah, I, I'm holding one that has two ends. Let me let me try and 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 uh, create a picture for those who are listening. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. So one side, it's a. Penis looking. It's a penis looking. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I'm like I'm trying to understand, and it has like uh, some ripples. It's a, it's a it's veins visible. in a way, kind of yeah, vein it has like, vein. It actually has a a, a leaf yeah. ingrained on it, and the other side literally looks like a rose flower. Flower. And you said this one, it thrusts and sucks at on the same time. Yeah. So one side thrusts, the other yeah. side sucks. And you you do you when you can you activate one? I think you can. And then not the other. Actually, yeah. Oh, there you go. Oh, yeah, this, this is, is just... Yet. So the other button is for the other Oh, one. so that is... <laughs> I don't know if you're... If you're, if you're... Yeah, let me, let me bring you closer. <laughs> just, I want you to see this. Let's just... Do you see that? And that's just number one. It has number 10 as well. Do, oh, so yeah, so, so the more you press... Oh, it just... Okay, let's... Yeah, just press one. Oh, so the speeds. Yeah, okay. There you go. Oh, wow. Okay. This is those ones when you go like, oh, Hada. <laughs> Hada. Oh, Don't wow. stop. Yes. Okay. So I just love how toys have evolved. Mm. And I just love how even you, when you're, when you're new into toys and you want to introduce to your partner as well, yes. it's easy to introduce something like this, for example, mm. compared to this humongous dildo that's, 20 inches. <laughs> okay, don't do too much. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, so it's easy to introduce even these tinier toys yes. than than to bring a whole Yes. But yeah, then again communicate, communicate with the partners, yes. communicate is very, also very I'm important. Cuz I'm thinking like with cuz also with us with a let's say with a tiny toy. Yeah. I'm like you st- I still need you here. So yeah. you're you're holding it, yeah. you're rubbing that and then you also get cuz for me I I, th- I assume. Mm. I assume that a man should enjoy or your partner rather should enjoy seeing pleasure all yes. over your face. I think like you should be staring down at me and just like on. it should, you should be so turned on that yeah. you're like you are part of this and you're like oh my god you're the you know, yeah. like I'm, I'm I'll give an example the, the first guy who ever made me squat now initially it was alone solo yeah. but the first guy who made me squat for the first time I first of all I was in shock. Yeah. I was like, <laughs> But then again, yeah. I'm like, he was like, hmm. Man, and I told like him. so proud. I was like, hmm, hmm. Oh, my God. He was really, really proud. He was yeah. like, oh, my God. Because I told you, I'm being very honest, I've never squatted. With mm. And so when it happened, like, uh, dating, like, mostly in the fourth of whatever month it was. Yeah. And it happened. Mm-hmm. You should have seen him doing a happy dance. Ah. Hey. He was like, ah, ah, eh, I made her squat. So yeah. men also feel joy mm-hmm. in seeing you in seeing the women pleasured yeah pleasured yeah and then also knowing you are, you are the reason you are the reason yeah because yeah. now also with the i think when you introduce a toy i'm not thinking at it, oh my god the toy did that no this was a joint effort we all worked together all three of us yes to make sure we were all pleased yes right yes so i don't think you should i don't think men should be intimidated by toys i think they should also try and find out like even you you probably like it yeah so you you know, to warn it. the way me i'm running it on my body and i'm like oh ooh, my ears oh around of uh, my nipples yeah if cuz you're a guy i'm assuming if you're a guy who likes cuz there's guys who like nipple play hey, oh, now i'm yes. imagining i'm i'm running my my cut <sighs> yes, thingy yes, on your nipples just as when honey yeah as <laughs> kind of kind of I know, right? Like exactly. Try, try it on yourself as well. Yeah, because I, I know there are guys who actually can't even reach get an orgasm without their nipples being played with. Hey, sucked. Yes. Why exactly? A small the nape of your neck. No, the nape like, of your neck. No, exactly. I'm it's not just my fingers. There's like yeah. the vibration. The vib- of, yes. We're helping each other out Le- over here. Yes. And now you see, we can go more rounds. Yeah. I'm just exactly. <laughs> Like we're saving time. Go on a. We're sex- being efficient. Go on a sexcation. 
I'm really yes. into those things. Just like it's just me and you. Yeah. It's just sex, no first today, not sex tomorrow. I weekend in the Nyanduana. I that name, but yeah. <laughs> yeah. Right. yeah. I'm really into people. I'm really, 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 really deep into couples really enjoying their sex. Yes. Yeah. Ah, I love that. And I'm not to mean that he won't go and cheat. That. Let him go cheat. But uh, you know, let him go cheat. Yeah. No. You know, men are. You know. <laughs> yeah. Ah, but maybe I don't buy exactly. it. Exactly. Maybe me too. I don't buy nah. it. Ah, if you're cheating, it's because you want to go cheat. It has nothing to do with being a it man. It never has to do with being a man. Or be, yeah. Funny as we don't get eh. on. We don't see men and go like, oh my God, who eh. are you? Yeah. And like I've said. It. But then that you know, doesn't mean I just go. A man can just put his penis here and I shall come. So, don't go say it is because she's not giving me good sex. Or eh, she's like, oh, no, 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 no. Any hole, any hole is a hole for a man. <laughs> I'm sorry, any hole. Shimo ni shimo. Beba, shimo ni shimo. Shimo ni shimo. What advice would you give? So again, we back back to say a single mm. lady, and now it's like we've said they start with the uh, the cleat. So yeah. now let's say uh, maybe I'm not someone who ninis with a cleat. What what would be the next? Step? You can never go wrong with a rabbit. Yeah. Oh my God! This is a rabbit. Uh huh. I think this is another. Oh, and this is a rabbit. So a rabbit vibrator is a toy. You can show them mm-hmm. that has both. Uh, so whatever has two. Okay. So that goes to the G spot once you insert it inside yourself like that. Mm-hmm. So it's positioned in a way to go up to your G spot, and yes. the other is this left. This is why the, the people who are listening oh, yeah. go check out our our nini. Go check it out on the video. On, on the video as well, because some of these things you actually have to see it. This on the clit. Hello. Yeah. I wanna give you. I wanna, this is a toy that I, I talk about a lot because. Yeah. <laughs> this toy vibrates to sounds okay. to your voice. Oh. The more you talk, it does whatever. Oh really? Mm. Hello. I'll give you an example. Hello. Just do anything. I just just oh, talk. Yeah. Oh my god. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> oh my god. Oh wow, it's vibrating to my sound. Or so if you want to masturbate I to music see. or whatever, it plays that it Oh my listen. When you keep okay. quiet. Oh my god. There we go. and I'm not touching the buttons. That is just me. Oh my godding. Oh, oh my god. god. <laughs> That's with the intro. Yes, I know. <laughs> I love it. Yeah. Oh, and then now there's oh there's the music thing. No, no. The, the, oh, yeah. that's now it just picks yeah. up on sound. Sounds. This one is good. Eh. So you don't even have to be like you don't. You, if you get a you know like the way people go like oh if I'm ninning it myself you're holding it yourself. You don't have to worry when you you're don't have this to. One. Yeah. Just play your music whatever you want to play. So you're oh. me along whatever. Yes. Yeah, so just play so that. Okay. But yeah. So again the guys who don't who are not watching the video. Mm-hmm. So unlike a penis, a penis is just a straight thing. Yes, it's just this one da, 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 da. Is exactly. And not just curve. It, it, it also has, has an extra Ah, uh, yes. cuz now a mini penis. I don't know how to put it. <laughs> just a mi- a mini penis for the <laughs> for the kids. So it's like it, it's you get double the pleasure. It touches I, I, your. G-spot. I don't know if you've ever slept with someone who has kiku is called ngwati. Uh huh. Men who what are circumcised. Gwati? I don't know the English word. Uh huh. I'm only saying that because but I've what had. Happens? What happens? The, the people, the men who got circumcised, like typical kikuyu, uh, back in the day, uh-huh. uh, circumcisions for men, uh. and uh, Maasai men, mm-hmm. they were left with a. An extra for for pleasuring women. Oh, people who yes, those who circumcise you, they do the cut on you as a man. Mm. They leave. It's called angwatin kiku. Please, yeah. we'll look for it. I think the English. Eh, one. I don't know can, the word. We we'll look for it. We but it's basically an. Ex, it looks like I've got. I've, I've had men who actually have a rabbit vibrator. A, a rabbit. Like dick. their their dick is a. Yeah. Their penis is a penis. rabbit penis. And and that's how they are actually oh, circumcised. That, so that is what gave birth to the rabbit. Yes. Oh. Yes. Oh my lord! Yes, so it's it's, it's double oh, pleasure. I just said, oh my lord, when I'm holding that, one, <laughs> <be> fine. <laughs> so it's G spot for the rabbit mm-hmm. and kill at the same time. 
at this age. Yeah, so you don't have to use double your fingers. The pleasure. Double, double the pleasure. So you don't have to to be like, oh, that one's doing that. Let so me use your fingers yeah. For, for yeah. Oh wow! So this this is your best seller. Oh my God, the rabbit! You know, and everyone likes the rose. Yeah, we had seen earlier on. Yes, uh, but to me. I can't. You can't go wrong with a with a rabbit. Cause mm. double. Cause again, the rose is still no. It's a rabbit. Yeah. Let's stick to the rabbit. And then we've got people who are rabbit. into anal. Uh huh. Yes. Let's talk. Anal pleasure. It's not for everybody. I am the everybody. It is not for. There you go. <laughs> <laughs> it happened to me once. The following morning, I was like. <laughs> but I can't. Uh-uh, no. Can't I can't. I can't experiment. Yeah. <laughs> I was. Into me, yeah. When you were doing it, but then again, I was like, "No, I'm not into it. Uh, it's, it's not for everybody." But then again, introduction. Everything is all about communication with your partner. Yeah, babe, let's try. You know, not everything. Like, yeah, but uh huh. Also, my brace actually it has a remote. So oh, I know uh, people who wear this all day. No, I people wanted to weird. ask you about yeah. that because I also know about. Okay, not weird. Days. People are hot. <laughs> I wish I could do that because I can't. Yeah, yeah. All day. Is it vibrating? Yes. Yeah, okay. Huh? So it's like, I'm just, I'm just meeting and... Yeah? And you, I have you got a remote. So you can be... Yeah. No one knows. This is what yeah. you're doing. <laughs> like, what? Because okay. there are people who are actually... Let me tell you about the orgasms. Mm. And as much as you have the orgasm gap as women, yeah. we also orgasm differently. You yes. can come. Come mm-hmm. is mostly external clitoral. Mm-hmm. Uh, your clit is coming. Rubbing your nipples, you can come. Yeah. But internal can be either vaginal... Orgasms, you uh-huh. can have uterus orgasms. What? You can have anal orgasms. Know. Okay. They're so different. You, know, you can ha- you can hit your G spot uh-huh. and you can squat for women. So in yes. as much as the, the 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 orgasm gap is huge, we but actually the, enjoy maybe, you can actually there's a, li- a there's little bit other more layers. Maybe varieties and layers, yes. So maybe like the people who don't enjoy because there's people who don't enjoy Penetra- penetration, there's people so maybe their orgasms are elsewhere. Yeah, it could be elsewhere. Mm. It could be you know, it could be just the cleat. But then again, the G spot, because again, my company is called G Spot Kenya. So yes. I really talk about the G spot because the G spot isn't far off. Mm-hmm. It's just a couple of inches from your vaginal opening. Mm-hmm. So it doesn't need mean that you need a man with a big. The ones they say, oh, size. Nah. So it's true when we say size doesn't really doesn't matter. matter. Yeah, I want I, I want a big one. Yes, but yeah. <laughs> can you can you, can you also get have me a big there? One and not know how to what use are you, exactly? It. Yeah. That's the other thing. Because now I think for me that's that's what I usually think. I'm like, okay, fine, good for you. You have a big one. Do you know how to use it? I'm on a kujia to apa kuni umiza. I'm like when you flash it, ni kubela kini. I see mommy. You're saying yeah. I yeah. mean, right? Yes. Yes. That's true. Mm. Okay. So we have different ways of orgasm as women. Thank God for toys. Mm. Again, to be their aiding because if you've never had, a, I've had clients who've never had an orgasm before until they bought they, a toy. Oh, wow. And they're like, oh my God, I was missing. Uh. So thank God for toys and women empowerment. Yes. Because at least we are trying to close that, that gap. gap. Yeah. yeah. And... So okay, I think I don't even have. I, I and there's a lot of things to, yeah. up and up, but yeah, no, yeah. it's like I think yeah. you're an inimen, you talk the different um, orgasms. Yeah. I'm like, ah, okay. Yeah. I guess it goes back to the knowing, the doing, the experimenting, and you trying have to, you to, have to experiment. Out. You have to know your body. You have to, you have to communicate body. with the partner. If you're yeah. single, my dear, use this is them the time all to actually do all the research. Yes. If you're single, I mean, I, 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 as single yes. people, this is not nongeleshwa. Do all the research. Yes, do the research and know all the things. And touch yourself, know your body, so yeah. that even though you meet your, your your next partner, when whatever it is, at least you'll you will you you'll go there knowing this is what I like. Exactly. This is my body. This mm. is what makes me get to cloud yeah. nine or whatever. Yes. Yeah. Ah, what yeah. are you holding right now? You I am like holding balls. <laughs> yeah balls. <laughs> I'm holding kegel balls. Okay. People call them kegel. I call them kegel. Uh uh-huh. you know, Potato potato. So kegel balls are. Specifically to help tighten your pelvic floor muscles, mm-hmm. like not to say your vagina, but it's, it's the pelvic floor muscles. Yeah, they help you with having, like it or not, the older we get as a, as women, mm-hmm. honest to God, just like your boobs go down, when you it will happen. <laughs> your your vagina walls become weaker. Ah, uh, okay. You end up finding the older you get, uh, like our moms don't th- think about kegels, our moms or grandparents, when they're sneezing or whatever, you pee a little, things like that. Mm. So what the kegel balls do is just to help you tighten your vaginal walls with age, with childbirth. So many mm. things can contribute to your to your vagina, the, 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 the pelvic walls collapsing. It happens. Okay. It's, it's life. It's a fact. Uh-huh. So these are there to enable you to tighten them because okay. they have weights. 
There's a ball in there. Oh. Oh, yeah, and it's moving. I can't feel it. Yeah, so you once you insert the ball like a tampon, uh -huh. so you put the ball in just like you, you would a tampon. Oh. And, and then, then you just start squeezing your kegel ball, your kegels, oh. your muscles. So just, you squeeze the muscles yeah. when this is... And this ah. helps you. So the more the muscles are, are holding, the touching the balls, yeah. the more it's becoming tighter and tighter. Ah. You can feel it's a little bit heavier. Oh, so like they, they come in different the weights. So you start ah, with the, the light. This, this is the lightest. Yeah. It's quite no, no, light. This is twice as yeah. much. Okay, yeah. So it's heavy. It's just like going out to the workout. The more you're working out in the gym, the more you go increasing the weight. Yeah. So that's the weight. Oh. So that's okay. quite heavy. This is not heavy. So the next one is this one vibrates. Oh. And you wear it and it has a, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so in, in case you don't, you, you it's still like so a this ball. One, it's a, it, you can do two things at, at the, the same, same time. time. It vibrates. Oh, yeah, this one doesn't have the two things. Yes, so it's, ah. it has a remote control. You put it in. So it's two things. So you either enjoy the pleasure with the vibrations uh -huh. or the vibrations are tightening. Ah. It, it makes it easier to do your kegels, like a mechanical electric kegel surgeon. Ooh. Yeah. So by the time you're using that for three, four, five months. Oh, they're so cute, though. They're cute. <laughs> so the, I love that. Yeah. The toys are also very pretty. The colors, right? Yeah, the colors So by are the time nice. you're done doing your kegels in a couple of months, yeah. I can promise you, can your partner will even tell the, the, the difference. Oh, you nice. You can come We call it milking. You can milk your guy just once he's inside. You can just... Oh, there. There. Yeah. <clears throat> the kegel, kegel on his yeah yeah I, the yeah. one you hold yeah <laughs> do your kegels women <laughs> do your kegels every single day yeah balls are not required you can do the kegels naturally even, just the way even you... right now I'm doing them right now personally <laughs> <laughs> but do your kegels they really yeah. help in the future with the, first of all multiple orgasms strong intense mm. orgasms as much as obviously now and you can do them when you're just like chilling walking office, cooking walking, whatever doing you're things. doing cooking yeah ah. yeah oh, Love that. Yeah, so do your kegels, ladies. Did you, did you show them the the the, uh, the makeup? It's charging, sorry. Oh, yeah, we it. were actually <laughs> charging. Let me get it. Yeah, so we do have different toys just and this designs just for that. So you can use the top as a makeup on your face, actually. Oh, you can actually yeah, use it. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> or you can just <laughs> let those vibrations down there let me, let's just we asked her oh where that's true he made a zero to a hundred <laughs> real fast <laughs> so this one is designed like a makeup brush and also it has different settings oh okay It's like a song. <laughs> hey. Yeah. And it's so strong. I can like again in your handbag traveling. Who would know what that is? No one would ever be like, oh, madam, yeah. bono na tembe na makeup brush. No. No one will ever ask you that. So soft. It's so soft. <laughs> yes. Oh, and also the thing I like now is that the designs are so cute. I just love how these new designs are because back in the day you get you couldn't. I have seen the yeah. the photos and the videos. There's one I saw which I don't know if it was the first one ever, and I was like, why would anyone think this is a good idea? It was so big. It's big it's like, eh, it was like it's huge. It's just and, ugly. Eh, I love when they were trying to do it. It's like make it look like skin. Ah, no. <laughs> yeah, yeah. No, yeah, if yeah. I want skin, I'll just go get skin. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, I love the the way the designs are so. One, it's something so small. This one, you can just put it somewhere. No one will be like, oh, even if someone looks at this, they'll think, oh, it's my makeup brush. Mm. And even if you're seeing a power button, you'll assume it's those ones like it maybe rotates. But even no one even thinks that far. Yeah. Yeah. But it's like, yeah. oh, this is really cute. Mm. I love the way they look. Just like you would look at this, for example, you can show and, them. It yes. just looks like a maize cob. It's just like corn. Yeah. It's just... <laughs> <laughs> tiny and mighty. And this is long this is for long distance this is oh. an app controlled toy okay so if you have a like myself who has a long distance a partner mm -hmm. so he, ha he has the app or she has the app whoever has the app yeah. across the that globe oh. anywhere so I'm gonna, I'm gonna make an appointment. exactly make an appointment today we are using this toy together so cool. he tells you switch it on you do it and now he's on his phone on his app on his phone he starts doing bzzz oh, on his wow. side yeah so you'll come he'll make you come basically from that is so from cool. kisumu in nairobi i love that yeah because of 
turns on as well. So it's magnetic as you can see so that you can mm-hmm. meet on the panty. You can actually wear it on your panty. And then below oh. it, it exactly now the other side is the the yeah, just a magnet just to hold the pant in case you want to wear it. So you can do because there's those ones for also I was curious, there's like the panties that oh, have yeah. like a remote. They're, yes. And the panties such. have remotes. Yeah. yeah. There's th- some toys that look like uh, just like a panty liner with even wings. Mm. So you, you put the wings uh, uh, and then you on just, your panty. Ooh. And then you have the remote or you give your partner the app or a Bluetooth and you're good to go. Because those ones like now they're very good for long distance, uh, long oh. distance couples or even date nights. Oh, even, yeah. I'm a, like if you're trying to marinate yes, me from, and you're at the office and yes, I'm also at the office. Yes. You marinate me through the day. Yes. Can you can me say how to go na kitu to go na mkutano yes. later. You remind me. Like, but you I really love that. I really love couples who actually make an effort and a yeah. point of spicing things up. Like once you leave the house in the evening, in the morning, sorry, it's not like unakuja tu jenu mecho, eh ni mechoka babe. Oh, huh. No. During the day, the tea break, babe, I miss you. Oh my God, I can't wait to eat you tonight. Yeah, I can't wait right? to. Things like that. That's how it should be. You by know, now. like just. Just trying to spy. your partner is telling you ata 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 text ya kukunijia hali ya kuna no ni tu mekula eh ya na kukulwa si kila siku mtula si kila siku right you are kukulwa exactly unataka kukulwa unataka kukulwa and then even your partner like you just puts them in that oh my god oh my, yeah. i can't wait i can't and wait for you like to come back home you said exactly it's like a jiko that is how mm, you find marin- the that's how you jiko. that's how you marinate us because you don't just trap in the evening and you're like ah yeah, uh, yeah. it's time to do what <laughs> go, to, go to the boy the boys you what you yeah. come back home you coming with smelling of cigarettes and drinks i'm like no babe come on yeah we had a date make the effort yeah make the effort yes you can do go out with your boys it's, it's, it's allowed yes but just once in a, even middle of the even on tuesday randomly random the kids are in school unaenda unapitia uko break to office yako kimbe yako lunch time kuja hapa kwa gari kuja kwa gari ama your office lock the door in the office kwa meza Come Papa, on. We I love him like so. Ataka kwa quick. Ana kama no one will get there. Yeah. But still, like it's I can't the wait. Thought count. The thought count. Yeah. I'm really into communication. I'm really into couples who really want to make an effort yes. to have a good sex life. A healthy <sighs> a healthy sex, sex life. life. Yes. There's this thing where uh, people say, okay, not even people. Like there's this generally that when people get married, their sex lives actually take a dive. Yeah. What do you think? I've never been married, the but excitement. I assume it's true. I've been married. Yeah. Uh-huh. Yeah, okay. And then and more so once the kids come in, eh? Yeah, because now yeah. it's like so fast you get married, there's like a dive. Mm. And then kids come in and then it dives even deeper. Mm. And the saddest part, especially when we talk kids, especially people just start saying, oh, you know, now I, um, I view her as the mother of my mm. children and... I'm like she wasn't a ma- you made her the mother. She wasn't a you. mother before that. You she yeah. you were dating you had a very amazing you, you guys were ha- say, having sex in the car kitambo. What about change? Kids changed? Cuz now that's the thing. It's like I think everything goes it does go go back to communication. It goes about communication. Yeah. But but I also feel like y- yes it can go down depending most marriages people do say that the sex life went down once the kids c- came in. Yeah. But then again again make that effort. Make that effort of like no, let us not let. The, of course, it's gonna happen. Mm. One thing I've noticed actually is, you tend to find. Be, be, before women get to the age of forty, yeah, those childbearing ages. First of all, you're married, you have kids, mm-hmm. you have kids so quick. Nazana ni nini? Yeah. But now what normally happens is, once now the chick becomes forty, once now the kids are in school, they're in high school. Mm. No, no, she wants to go back to the game. Yeah. Now the man is like, so no, nice, hashes are the way. peak now because women, I don't know something about turning in your late 30s and turning 40s for yeah. women. Like, oh my God. It's the, like now the, I have more. A new less, less of life. Like you yeah. get more hornier as a woman as you progress. Yes. Especially when the kids are now settled. You're okay. Kids are doing Stress okay now. Stress me pungua. <laughs> So you find no, women... No, I have more time to exactly. think about other things. So in your 40s or whatever, it's not women are like, oh my God, I, wa- I found very many married women now having young boys yeah i've seen that in his 45 year old women 50 year old women most of so them have like, small bent ends who are keeping up with yes. with your sex life yes drive. exactly because now you mm. find this particular woman, married woman now the husband sex life is the older a man gets it, it's going low it's, it's going lower yeah. for a woman it's going higher yeah so a man you know erectile dysfunction the dysfunction mm. starts happening with age as well for men you know the, and they they're smoking they're, they're drinking they don't 
They don't they want talk about it. Mm. Right? So imagine a woman in 45 or whatever she or, or whatever age it is, not even the age matters. Yeah. She actually wants now, she's ready. She's like, oh my God, but Let's now the man go. can't. Yeah. So you find women are either they resort to toys or most of them not. Unfortunately, they're resorting into cheating yeah. with small, oh, small wow. boys out there. So you also Communication. have games. Oh, yeah, for couples. Oh, yes, you I have couple this one. games. This, this is my favorite. Uh-huh. This is a year, a year of? A year of sex, sexual position card. Yes. Ooh. So don't have a boring sex life, please. When you can have a don't be a ba- boring fuck. I keep saying that. Don't be a boring fuck. There, there are ways yeah, to so spice things up. So those are 54 cards. Mm-hmm. And here has 52 weeks, I'm yes. guessing, right? So there's some extra cards. So the card is basically, let's try out a new position this week. No, your joyride. Right? I did not need to do that on purpose. It's actually it's just back. Back. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah, joyride, actually. Yeah. Joyride each other. So it, it gives you... So oh, random. They actually teach you. They tell you how to go about the position. Yeah, <gasps> and it, 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 like they tell you, do you need a table? Do you mm. need a what is it? Is it like a kitchen counter? What is it? Yeah. So you have uh, fifty-four like cards. It looks. Like, what I think it? I'm, have I even tried it? I'm like I think I've participated in a joy ride. <laughs> my niece cannot. <laughs> <laughs> What's the technique? The technique. I don't have my glasses. What does this say? Um, it says, in this experimental position, there's a role reversal with thrusting. Mm. His thighs form a V-shape and she pivots at her knees up and down. What? Yes. Kuna in erotic embrace. She should keep her legs extended halfway and experiment with how tight or extended her legs should be. He thrusts from a kneeling position okay. and helps guide her legs into nice, pleasurable fits. I haven't had sex in nearly two <laughs> years. You're confusing me right now. <laughs> Jesus. <laughs> oh, I love exactly. this. Exactly. So yeah, spice things. Again, if you're not into toys, it's okay. Yes. There are other aids out there. Yeah, because this is also an yeah, age it's where you're a trying, sutra, really, yeah. You're trying things together. See missionary killer siku. I love missionaries katai. I'm a doggy person, I'm a missionary. But there are yeah. other sexual positions Position. out there. So Just try 54. them out. Yeah. So mm. day, every week. Oh also this one is good because yeah. it will actually keep your nini yeah. going. It's like, Let's try na, this. Ni let una ja, eh, Under your excitement. Una, no, eh, 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 it's but, like I kesha. wonder what we're doing this week. Exactly. Right? That's the whole point. Oh, I yeah. love this. Mm. So you also have games. Yeah, we also have games and cards and communication, how to communicate better with your partner, oh, how to have better we've intimacy. Talked about, we've talked about yeah. communication. Oh, it has 150 prompts. Yes. So it just prompts you to answer Anything certain the, questions. At the back? When conversations with your partner become scarce or superficial, intimacy, intimacy plummets. That's because intimacy is more than physical. Yeah. It's also the connection you feel on a mental, emotional, and even spiritual level. Strong relationships are built on strong communication. The intimacy deck is a tool you can use to keep on talking with your partner. Use it regularly to spark meaningful conversations that help you. Exactly. Non-sexual, just intimacy again. So there's so many like, things. Just, also there's those things where yeah. your man will say something and you're like, oh my God, this one is so hot. Yeah. Like that's how yeah. you think. Yeah. Ah! Exactly. Who you, who so you in, our, in our in our side, it's not just always going to the bar after you so have. So if you're not after willing, Jobo, if you're not willing to try the toys, there's other, other ways, mechanics. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. To make sure, because all this leads back to pleasure. Pleasure. I see a, a container of lube. <laughs> oh lube yeah. On the table. Yes. There's people who don't like lube. Yeah, it's not for everybody, especially nowadays. Ru- lubes, hey, rubes, kikuyo. Lubes <laughs> that have um. Uh, sweeteners or mm-hmm. artificial things, they're not good because they can give you UTI. Oh. So lube, I prefer lube to me that isn't flavored. Mm-hmm. Uh, an example is that there's no flavoring on that. Yes. You know all the strawberries, yes, they smell good. Mm-hmm. The strawberries, there's you, there's apple flavor. Yes, they have this car, nice car, whatever it is. Yeah. And, but then again, you can get an, uh, an infection because mm-hmm. it's sugar. Ah. Bacteria, you know, there's bacteria, and our ninis can grow. And then again, they, they, exactly, very good for growing very bacteria. Good for bacteria. Yes, it's the it's a perfect rule yes. for that. So if you're using lube, make sure you use lube that's natural. Uh-huh. Uh, if it's not natural, it's not flavored. Ah, yeah, okay. Yeah, don't go for these strawberries and all these things. What about like a man? If if say you're like you're now with uh, with your partner, for instance, right? And you ask them, you say, "Hey, please, Mimi, I'm not wet enough. I need you to lube up." And then they say, "No." What are you saying? Do not like, mention spit because I, I hate know, saliva. I gonna, I oh my god! Spit on it. Do, do. <laughs> 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 
<laughs> if there's one thing I hate, to me again, lube is an aid. Yes. Because it happens. It doesn't mean because I'm not wet, I'm not horny. Yeah. Like I st- I'm women, yeah, women I want us to keep going. You men should know women's anatomy. Like, you just don't think that she's wet and it's tacky. No, yeah. I want to. It's just how my body is. Time of the month, good example. Stress, mm. it's hot. Like me, when it's hot or it's, when it's a fun, like, I just get dry. Yeah. So, lubes, again, and it's also that it's kutaki, I'm, I'm, I'm not wet for you. I am mm. wet for you. I'm, I want you. I'm here. I'm just here. Let's it's just to help the sliding. Aid. Just to mm. aid. Everything's just here to aid because... And also, that it, like, it yeah. just communicates. If I'm telling you, lube up, it communicates, I want you inside me. Yeah. Hi. Yes. <laughs> like... <laughs> Let, and let's I, get there. And I will put it next to my to my skull. What that table next yeah, to the side the, table? The side table, it's there. Yeah. What do you want? I mean, whether you should come to my room. What do you want? Handcuffs? Shika. <laughs> but then my house no, is sex house. Also... Think about it. <laughs> <laughs> what about now things like that? There's the uh, the BDSM. The yeah. Handcuffs. The... How how do you again introduction again communication, yeah. babes? It's all about. But then again. What are you doing with these toys? People mm. think that you're coming to bring your in the bedroom and stuff. Yeah. <laughs> Communication again. There's soft porn. Oh my God. Soft BDSM. There is rough BDSM. It depends on what kind of BDSM you, you, you're into. But then again, it's again, just try. Mm. If it's not for you, it's not for you. Yes. Because when I started personally my BDSM journey, I used to, just a normal spunk. I mm. just, I was like, hard. I'm like, I, mm. then you can go now to the, to the to the, the whips, the whips uh-huh. right? Like, do you want to be tied up? Mm. It may not be your thing. Yeah, because but let's try. Yeah, it's, ooh, like, where, 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 where. Death. What if yeah. uh, you want to kill me? Whatever mm-hmm. you know. So communicate again. Yes. See if it's for you. If it's not for you, then that's also continue. okay. You that's tried okay. the things that work. You've for tried because you. yes. uh, the good thing about BDSM kids, it's a whole range of even like seven products. Mm-hmm. So it's, it's not just the whip. Mm-hmm. You know, not just handcuffs. There could be like blindfolds. Yeah. There could be some soft nipple clams. There's so many things and diversities and mm-hmm. different toys for you to introduce. You don't have to be like at a, you're being spanked for you to at blood and safe <laughs> safe words. You yeah. don't have to go that far That's of right. safe words where yeah. there's also blood and the guys who like that pain, pain, pain. Mm. But the guys who actually just want like minimal spunk and just yeah. the tingling. It's like a like yeah. a sensation, sensation, logo. sensation. That's the word. Yeah. Ah. Again, communicate. Yeah. Google. Mm. Go see what, what what works for you. Try what doesn't work for you. Try new things. Yeah. Even use a tie at home. Just mm. you don't have to even get the cuffs. Just a normal tie. Yeah. Just tie your hands. See how it feels to be, you know, tied up, and mm. you might really, really enjoy it. You're like, wow. If you want to be role play dominant, things, exactly. Yeah. Role play. Buy spice things up. Do you want to be a nasty? Do you want to be a teacher? Do you want to be a secretary? You know? Yeah. Like live out your fantasies. Fantasies. What yes. do you think when, when people are thinking about fantasies, uh, would you encourage people to try out their fantasies with their partners? But talk to them first. Again, uh, communicate. Communication. Yeah. <laughs> what if they get angry? Is it because hey, can you think about that guy? Uh, yeah. When you're, maybe yeah. there's a specific guy yeah. in your life they think about and they're like, Oh, Cooper, I, I, trying, I won't be surprised. Maybe to be so and so. But what if you never know but when you have sex with a partner, you yeah. don't know where the brain is. Maybe think about their ex. Who was Oh yes. Actually Even you, know, you could be thinking about your ex, you could think about anyone else. How about and, your mother? <laughs> like it's like I'm using your body. <laughs> But in mind, yeah, it's someone else. Exactly, and it's fine. You should be so long as yeah. it gets you there. So long as you don't mention his name, eh, what's his name? Kutana, this is me. I'm me. I'm always a babe. Pass. Hey, babe, babe. I'm like, oh, babe. Yes, I feel so good. Yeah. I will never call you by your name <laughs> because what if I forget? I mention <laughs> someone else's name. Be like, eh? Kadik kana hoha no. <laughs> Yeah. yeah, yeah, yeah. So but I yeah. think basically from this conversation, what I'm noticing is like a lot of things lead back to one, knowing yourself and knowing your body. Yeah. And two, if you are with a partner, communicating with your partner. Yeah. And now in in doing those two things, pleasure comes a lot easier. <sighs> Much more easier. You, you'll be surprised that you, you may never even have to fake an orgasm again. Yeah. If you have very good communication skills with your partner, mm-hmm. you may find out, you, oh my God, yeah. Never again. But if you're not partnered, if you're a single <laughs> girl, babes, do whatever. Try do everything. everything. <laughs> I've always been I'm a person of like fuck anything but a cactus and animals. You know? Yeah. yeah. Sample. Before, yeah, some, I'm, a, I'm, I'm, I'm a big believer of sampling. I'm yeah. sorry. Me, I'm not going to be here like, oh, marriage. No. <laughs> yeah. When I, will, there, yeah. I will build that. Uh, it's called what we're talking about. Uh, what are you talking about? About. 
number of people. It's called oh, what? body count. Body count. <laughs> yes. Build that body count. Who cares? What's a body count anyway? What does it do for me? Who, eh. Ah, and there's yeah. no at the last scene come you say as you know. <laughs> see what's up. Yeah, see what's up. Yeah. At the last scene. No, 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 no. <laughs> it doesn't say that I was here next. Please. Yes. Enjoy so sex true. responsibly. Yes. Consent. Mm, consent. Consent is, is very, very important. Those yeah. were very vital in relationships. Very vital. Again, because even the communication part goes back to consent. Yes. Do you like this? Does. Should mm. you try this? Are you into this? Are you open to this? Are you this? open to this? Yeah, yeah. just communicate. Yeah. Oh, communicate, communicate. That. And again, please, if you're single, have sex. Yes. So you're going to be called a hoe. <laughs> What is in a name? What is in a name? What is in your exactly, name? Exactly. Yes. Yes. Yeah. 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 Where do we yeah. find you? We want now to call like Bev and to pair courage. Yes. Tunataka kutafuta Bev. Because your courage is coming to moja. In case you're scared of calling me, people are scared of even DMing me. Really? Yeah. Oh my gosh, she knows that I bought a toy. Oh my god, I don't care. Baka una create the name. Yeah. Account. And people <laughs> do that a lot, and then you see. After two minutes, zero, zero Instagram followers, zero nothing. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> too, you too, and yeah. So if you're scared of that, just go to the website directly. Mm. Uh, gspotkenya.com. So yeah. www.gspot, one word, gspotkenya.com. Well, guys on YouTube, we'll have it here. We'll also have it in the description box yeah, and so the show notes. Yeah, so the website has eh, over 200 toys. Yeah. Yeah, I've been to your website. Yeah, so it's easy to know how Yeah. Variety. That variety. So you can order the uh, f- from the website. Mm-hmm. The good thing is we deliver countrywide. Yes. And not just countrywide, Uganda, Tanzania, uh, Juba, as in, yeah. East so Africa. East Africa is included. Take, so yeah. we deliver ah, countrywide nice. and East Africa as well from G-Spot Kenya. Mm-hmm. Uh, Instagram is the, not there. Yeah. Hey, this guys the. keep going my account. <laughs> so it's the double E. I think you're going to put that up. Yes. So it's the vibrating lawyer. Yes. Or G Spot Kenya. Kenya underscore. Okay, I'll have yes. all the links down below. Yes. Thank you so much. Don't fake orgasms. If you want to fake an orgasm, come to me. I'm going to show you how not to <laughs> fake an orgasm. <laughs> it's like once you get it, you'll be like, ah, I'm never doing Never the faking, faking thing it again. again. Yes. But I enjoy pleasure. Enjoy yourself. Know your body. Yes. You know, just even looking at the mirror. Mm. Just when you want to have a shower. Just look at the mirror. Yes. I know. Oil oh, yourself. It's the most from, beautiful. Yeah. I always oil myself. I love that. And I lotion and oil myself in front of a full length mirror. Yes. Every single freaking day. Exactly. Yeah. And Enjoy that like, body. I even have a bad day and the moment I stand there, Ooh, you're I... You're like, you I'm labor. I'm labor. I'm labor. labor. <laughs> <laughs> exactly. Depend. Yeah. You have to... And it, it has to start with you. It's honestly. from within. Everything has to start with you. Because, you know, the oiling part is very sex, sex, sexual and sensual. Yes. You know, just look at yourself. <laughs> Appreciate it. It doesn't matter. You, you, you may not like your body, but guess what? That is the body, the you, body have. you have. Yes. Enjoy the body. Have you know, I'm too skinny. I'm too fat. No, yeah. it's your body. Whatever. It's the one you have. Yeah. And enjoy it and, and, and accept who you are as a person. And the more you accept who you are and the more you... You, ha- you have an open mind, the more you're going to have multiple amazing orgasms. Okay. Yes. We are closing that orgasm gap by fire, Tringe. by, by force. force. <laughs> Thank you so much. I really Karibu, Karibu. Like, hey, Nimelan, multiple ways yes. to Yes. Mm-hmm. But I'm so grateful that, <laughs> that you decided to, you ag- agreed to have this conversation Thank with you. us. Do you offer like lessons for women if someone is like, I don't oh, know, do you have bachelorette? No, anything? most of the time I normally host a lot of bachelorette parties and bridal ah. showers where I will bring you some strippers as well. What? 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 We're gonna talk about how to how to squat. I give lessons on how to squat. Uh-huh. If you never squatted before, I'll teach you how to squat. Giving head. Giving head. Oh my god, yeah. I'm very good at giving head. Yeah. Yeah. It's been a minute. <laughs> but I haven't <laughs> had <laughs> sex in nearly two years. Yes. <laughs> willingly, willingly. Yeah. I just want to decide to go celebrate for a, for a bit. You know, sometimes you just mm. need to, you know. I get that, yeah. Yeah, yeah so I do have some lessons of, you know, uh, uh, blowjob lessons and, mm. yeah. Okay, that's cool. Yeah. I love that. So my Instagram so has everything, so yes. If you are seeking any of these services, now I mean, Najwa, the next person, if you're my friend and you're getting married, don't make me the leader of your bachelor things. Mm-hmm. I know who I'll call. <laughs> I know who I'll call. Thank yes, you so much. Yes, Karibu. Thank you really for having me as well. This. Yes. Thank you for being a part of, you know, watching, listening and everything. We will see you in the next episode. Bye. Bye-bye. Bye.